Hello, good sir, how are you? Distinguished guests, children, ladies and gentlemen, a very good morning to all of you. I am Rohit Babar, <coughs> First Secretary in the Permanent Mission of India to the UN, and I extend to you of the celebration of the 74th Republic Day of India. Happy Republic Day to everyone. To begin the proceedings, we will have unfurling of flag by Ambassador Shirindramani Pandey, Permanent Representative of India to the UN, and other international organizations, which will be followed by a playing of national anthem and reading of President's message by Ambassador and his speech. I will also request everyone to, to observe the solemnity of the occasion by keeping your mobile phones on the silent mode and do not indulge in any conversations during the national anthem as also during Ambassador's speech. I will request Ambassador Indramani Pandey sir to unfold the flag please. She has underlined that as G20 represents about two-thirds of the world's population and around 85% of global GDP, it is an ideal forum to discuss and find solutions for global challenges. To her mind, global warming and climate change are the most pressing among them. She has reminded us that we need to modify our lifestyle if we want our children about the first Indologist today. The first Indologist to be honored today by Ambassador Indramani Pandesar is Sophia Still River. I'll say a few words about her. Born in Morocco, Sophia Still River is a spiritual teacher, an award-winning author, a public speaker, and the French biographer of His Holiness the Dalai Lama. She co-authored four books with him, translated into over 20 languages, 
and adapted his life story for the screen of the biopic Dalai Lama One Life After the Other. Sophia is the founding president of Be the Love, a transformational program of heart and mind, awakening for leaders and change makers to shift from individualism to altruism. Sophia co organized Better We, Better World seminars in Dharamshala, India, bringing together young global leaders. Sophia has been a regular speaker at the UN and will host an event to celebrate International Day of Conscience on 5th April 2023 at the Palais de Nation, addressing the theme of conscious leadership and a session on relevance of Indian philosophy and Gandhian values. It's my great pleasure to request and invite Sophia Sildreva to please come over here and I will request Ambassador Indrabani Pandey sir to honor her with presentation of the shot. The third Indologist to be honored today by Ambassador Indramani Pandey sir is Mary François Besson. Born in 1946, Mary did her bachelor's in developmental psychology and master's in educational psycho approaches and situation for children with disabilities. She did extensive training in Thank you, sir.